Yeah, we're not even gonna be able to see in that. Guys, right now I am pond hopping. Uh, it's like 80 degrees outside in Illinois, and it is just feeling dandy. Um, usually for most of these ponds, I have only like a few spots that I actually spend my time on. So this is one of them. I just usually, I think like right off, like it comes out of, like the water comes out of this bridge and then right out of this channel, there's like a drop off, or like a hole or something right where I just cast it. And I just kind of drag my bait back or swim it back, whatever I'm using. And usually I'll get hit, usually. Oh, I just had a fish. Oh, I feel really stupid. Yeah, that was definitely a fish. Crap. Fail number one, folks. Oh, there's another one. Oh, come on. Oh, got one. <laughs> That's hilarious. Boom, there we go. That's hilarious. I literally popped, I popped this worm out of this fish's mouth. And he hit it again oh drag him up yep i love that good way to start out the day that was funny i had a bite right out there and i was kind of like pulling up my uh pole to like make sure it wasn't a snag and it was definitely a fish i, I felt like my uh line start to tug and wiggle and whatnot that's a nice little pound pound and a half whatever it's a nice way to start it out get out of here all right well, that's a good sign. <coughs> this warm weather is definitely helping these fish bite, I guess, or I hope. But that was funny. I, uh, I had a fish on, and then he came off. And then I started jerking it again. And then I, I set the hook on him, and I missed it. And then as I was reeling it in to cast out again, he hit it again. So, I mean, I'm down with that. I'm down with that aggressiveness. All right, bass? I'll take that. I will take that. Let's see if we can get another one back to back cast. <clears throat> oh, there's another one. Another one. Another one. Yes, sir. Back to back cast. I'm telling you, right when I pass, right when I get past this uh, opening here. Yes, sir. Doubling up. Come on. How to get a hook out 101. Ah, there we go. All right, back to back cast, guys. Not huge fish, but listen. Whew. With the spring that we've had so far, I will take that. I will take that. I have not caught, or ha I haven't had a good bass day, and I'm not even kidding you maybe probably since last year actually probably since last season all right <clears throat> let's go ahead and try that back corner over there shrimp scampi all righty then see you know what i mean like how is there a carton of eggs like how I don't understand people. This is why there's no trespassing signs at ponds and lakes now. It's because all these people just come here and they just trash it. Let's see if we can get one before we leave this pond. I've got a couple others. I got actually in this area I have at least like seven or eight others. I mean this this area of Illinois is just freaking stocked with private ponds. Is that a fish? Yes, it is. That is a fish. Oh, that's a nice one. It's a decent one. It's a decent one. I'll take that. Okay. I don't even know you're on there, buddy. God, this thing is thin. Good Lord. I need to eat. Maybe that's my fault, though. Keep thinking that everything's a lure. I mean, not bad. There he goes. 
This might be a good video today. Well, fuck. Okay. We're gonna go hit these other ponds before it gets dark here. What time is it? Do I even have my phone on me? Yes. Oh, it's only 3.43. Alright, we got time. But, uh, I'm definitely gonna go hit these other ponds right now. Because some of them are kind of like sightsee. Sightsee. Like sight fishing. And I want the sun to be in my favor when I'm fishing them. Because, you know, it's always nice to see the fish when they hit you. Well, I'll get back to you as soon as we get to the other spot. Okay, well, we're at the uh, second spot. I don't have any confidence, to be honest, in this pond whatsoever right now because of how crazy this wind is. I probably surf on these waves right now. Yeah, we're going to go try one more spot on this pond before the next one. This wind is so crazy. It's so crazy. It's so crazy. I mean, oh my god, okay. Don't even get me started on these no trespassing signs. They say no boating, no ice skating, no skiing, no waterboarding, no river rafting, no jet skis, no tubing, etc. etc. And then it says this lake is catch and release only. And then on the bottom of that sign, right here, it says warning no trespassing what are you saying what kind of message is that what kind of warning is that yeah you can't do this 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 and this it is a catch and release lake but you can't trespass here sorry what is that and we're back uh yeah i know i know it's cliche i fish this spot a lot but Honestly, it's the only pond producing right now, and I just don't want to hear it. I don't know what else to tell you. It's the only place that I've produced out here this year, and I'm just going to go ahead and take advantage of it while it's hot. Because I'm telling you right now, this is not the best pond out here, which is why I don't understand why it's so productive right now. Oh, did you see that? Good Lord. That one. <laughs> oh, it's a nice one too. Yep. Good stuff. Holy crap, that was awesome. That was awesome. Did you see that, guys? I literally tossed it at that wall, and the second it hit the bottom, he destroyed this. Look at that. That's a decent, probably a pound and a half, two pounds right there. That was awesome. Now we're back at this channel spot. Going to see if we can scoop some more before the day ends. later in the afternoon now so guess we'll have to see fish fish yep decent one too there we go yes sir Sorry, I had to get a little Snapchat in there. Like I said, guys, not the biggest fish, but seriously, I mean, they're fun to catch. Especially for how early in the season it is. Whoop. Got him. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. I'll take that. I will take that. Yes, sir. A little bit longer. I mean, they're all about the same size, 
but oh, not bad, not bad at all. Ooh, almost time for a new worm. Ripping up on the top there. Oh, yes, sir. Oh, no. Oh, no. I waited way too long on that. Got one. There we go. There we go. Yes, sir. Do some acrobatics. Yep. Yes, sir. You know, these might be the same fish. <laughs> nah, he's a little bit smaller. Okay. Very productive evening right now. I'm getting a, a bite or a fish on every cast almost. Absolutely stacked. Got another one. <laughs> oh my god, this is crazy. This is just one after the other. You're getting smaller though. Which is not fun, but... Take it. I'm telling you, this exact spot, I'm throwing to the exact spot every single time. I get a fish or a bite on almost every single cast. Is that a fish? Is that a fish? What are you doing? What is that? God, that's a horrible hook set, but I just don't know if it's a fish or not. What the? Okay, hold on. I'll let that sucker drop. That's a fish, I think. There he is. Took you long enough, buddy. Jeez. Yes, sir. Slinging these things, man. Ooh. Tried to be fancy. Oof. Chill out. <laughs> Got my worm all discombobulated. The spot is hot. This spot is definitely hot. Oh, I think I got another one, guys. Yep, got another one. <laughs> oh my goodness. I don't even understand it. I don't understand it. These guys are just stacked in there, man. Absolutely stacked. Ones and twos, but I'm looking for a three or four at least. Ah, oh, my battery's low on my camera. Running out of camera battery. Gotta crank some more before that happens. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> oh my god, guys. Guys, guys, guys. I can't even explain to you what is going on right now. I have been standing in this one spot slinging bass after bass after bass. I mean this has to be my 8th or ninth at least. And I'm, it's every cast, literally every cast. Good lord. Alright guys, unfortunately I just got kicked out of the pond. Luckily my GoPro battery died right as it happened, but um, yeah, I mean it happens often. I've been fishing at this particular pond for, I mean, four to five years now, and I've only actually gotten kicked out twice. So, uh, I mean partially because I'm literally parked right on the street where the pond is usually I park like across the street in the suburbs behind me uh, to make it seem as if like I live here but yeah um, that's how that went uh, it was a pretty good day today I'm not gonna lie uh, we really started lighting it up at the end of the day unfortunately we have to go now but uh, this pond really started lighting up toward the end of the day I mean just one after the other but I hope you guys enjoyed the video today uh, it was a good day the weather was nice the wind was unbearable but we did catch fish so i don't know what i was gonna say anyway have a good day 
Thank you for watching and make sure to like and subscribe.